Welcome back. I'm Bruce Johnson with Tip Vision. Chances are somewhere in your house, basement, or garage, there's an old chair with a familiar problem. It's too well made to be thrown out, but it's not pretty enough to be used. Sounds like it's an ideal candidate for a quick and easy makeover. Old pieces of furniture from the 40s and 50s often have an old shellac or dark lacquer finish. And as they darken, they don't look as pretty as they used to. But it's easy to remove this old shellac or lacquer finish using a furniture refinisher. Simply pour the refinisher into a shallow bowl, then dip in either a piece of steel wool or a synthetic scrubbing pad. Then, working on a small section at a time, gently begin scrubbing off that old finish. The furniture refinisher will soften the finish and the pad will soak it up. You can then take a clean cloth, dip it in the refinisher for a final wipe down. Now after it dries, you should go back and give it a light sanding with number 220 grit sandpaper just to smooth out the wood. Then you can apply both color and protection at the same time with a one step stain and finish product. Now in this case, I'm gonna use polish aged pecans and I'm gonna apply it with a natural bristle brush with fine tips on the end. It's important that you put on the polish shades in thin coats because this will help you avoid any runs or drips. Chances are you're just gonna need one coat because you're putting on both your color and your protection at the same time. But for a deeper, richer look, you can add a second coat later. Now giving your seat an easy makeover is also fun. Simply take off the old seat with the four screws held to the framework, then turn it over. Chances are you can reuse that original plywood platform and the foam that's over it. You can simply wrap it with a new bright fabric and hold it in place with a hammer and some upholstery tacks. And that's all there is to it. It's a quick and easy fix. It saves an old chair and it saves you some money. I'm Bruce Johnson and that's today's tip.